Like, there's nothing to cover up. Of course there is, because there's no warrant. They broke in there, and I'm supposed to report the sheriff's department to you. You want to have Timmy the Perjurer Riley investigate himself. That's not going to happen. Chief in? God, the door is locked in a public place. It says no smoking, it doesn't say no entry. Chief! Hello. Just the guy I wanted to see. How's it going today? Super, how about yourself? Not too bad. Well, that's good. Say, uh, how's this uh, investigation going along? What investigation are you referring to? Uh, the one I filed a complaint about. Do you want to see the complaint number and everything like that again? Sure, sure. Let's see. It's uh, 2011 Does that ring a bell? This is a complaint that you filed with Officer Running? Yes. The other day? Yes. Okay. Yep. So now you're, now you're familiar with what we're talking about, right? Uh, I saw the, the video that you came in and, or gave me here good. on Monday. Yep. And, it, and it works then? It works. Yep. Good, good, yep. good, good, good. I'm, I'm happy about that. So then, uh, so are we stalled with the investigation? Are you actually here's, looking into it? Or? Here's, what, here's what's going to happen, Terry. Okay. <clears throat> uh, we have the statement or that tape that you provided us. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, with the report that you made with the officer Rowning. Okay. 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 And we'll forward that down to the prosecutor. Oh, so you're going to forward it to the prosecutor? Correct. Okay, so you haven't investigated this at all then, then right? Yes, we have. Uh, oh, so did you call down to to the court administrator's office to confirm the fact that there's no warrant there? Because that's what Christopher King, investigative journalist and former assistant attorney general, if did. You, if you have a complaint, uh, Terry, in yeah. regards to uh, the sheriff's department, yeah. okay, uh, then you need to make that complaint with them. No, no, no. See, this is a, this is a uh, home invasion by them. So why do I want uh, Tim Riley, the guy who committed perjury, to investigate himself? Well, that would not be for our agency to investigate. Well, actually, it is. You're supposed to investigate them. See, I actually know how this works. See, okay. so the thing is, so you're saying that you haven't called down to confirm the fact that uh, there was no warrant, then, right? Uh, what we've done, like I said, is taken the CD that you gave me. Right. Okay? Right. Uh, I'll have a report on that. I will forward it to the prosecutor for their review. Okay. Yeah, I've Thank already you. heard all this. Well, so you didn't you didn't call down there to confirm the fact that I there's no. Okay, good. That's what I wanted to hear. Okay. Alrighty. Now, well, I guess this must be an internal thing then. Okay. Because look, here on uh, September 7th, see, here's the date, September 7th, 2011, uh, here's a little deputy. You recognize that guy? Yes. And who is that? That is Deputy Joshua. Okay. What's that on his right shoulder there? Where are you looking? I think that's his right shoulder right there. His cell phone? Cell phone looks like a tape recorder to me. Yeah, it's a cell phone. Really? And what's this? Where are you looking? Right there. And you recognize this guy? That is Officer Jim Kahn. Yeah. Okay. That would be his microphone. Yeah, what's the one below it? And that is his uh, recording system for his camera, the N Squad camera. Oh, That does okay. not take video, it's just audio. Oh, okay. Just audio. So it's, he's Correct. taking audio right now then? I don't know. Okay. I don't know if it's activated or not. Oh, okay. Okay. Because... Um, um, let's see now. See, I don't believe that's a cell phone. I believe that's a tape recorder. Well, I'm not going to argue about it. Right. It's a cell phone. Right. But you can believe whatever you want. Right, right. Well, see, the, the problem is, is that, uh, I'm supposed to be getting exculpatory evidence from, uh, in regards to this case, and they're claiming that, uh, boy, there's no tape recorders and stuff like that. And I certainly think that, uh, this is being recorded because this, this statement right there, came straight out of verbatim what was said there. You know, and I, I didn't really remember what it said. But you know what? After I watched the video, that's exactly what was said. Again, Terry, if you have an issue with... No, 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 see... Or if you think that he has evidence that they're withholding from you, then you'll have to deal with that through the Sheriff's Department. Well, see... we wouldn't have access to that or have Well, that. see, actually, I, like I said, I do believe that uh, both your guys had tape recorders on them at the time. That's See, that's what I do believe. Okay. See, and uh, I do believe that that's being withheld from me because of uh, one little incident that happened here. Hold on to that for me. That happened on Monday. Of course, you know I had a little kangaroo court uh, trial on I Monday. Know, I know you had a jury trial on Monday. Yeah, kangaroo court. Okay. In which um, 
surprisingly, this video evidence, uh, well, actually, the one where uh, I'm video videoing in the uh, law enforcement center, the law enforcement center, let's put it that way. Um, according to this rule here, they weren't allowed to play the video or the audio of that video because um, Mr. Roth, a guy who's been a lawyer for years and years and years and years, just didn't remember that he had to send me a transcript prior to the trial. And isn't that awful? Uh, you know, again, Terry, that's something well, that you know, I that's, can't comment on. Uh, that, of course you know, I know. I, I know that. But see, it's just so convenient, isn't it? See? that, And now, guess what's going to happen on Monday? Because i got another little kangaroo court trial now. And you know what they're going to do? They're not going to allow me to uh, play any audio on that, that video again. So then, you know, any little fairy tale is just going to be spewed anytime they want, right? Just like they did on Monday. See, because if you watch the video and listen to the little fairy tale, you know they don't match. Again, Terry, I wasn't there in court. I right. don't know what was said. Right, so. right. Come on in. Come on. Come on through. I'll sneak by you. Yeah. Yep. We should be doing this in the police station, but they're scared to bring me in there. I, I've been in there before doing it, but they're scared it's, of it now. Terry, so. it's not that we're scared to bring you in there. Right. It's just that when you come in there with cameras, there's stuff out that, that's laying out that's data privacy is protected. Really? Because I, I was in there. You're right. Uh, that's you're right. right. So in other words, you weren't uh, protecting people's data back then? Is that what you're saying? I should not have allowed you to record. Right, in there. right. It's because like, now you're trying to go I'm along with these guys over there. I'm not covering up anything. Really? Then how come you didn't call over to uh, court there, administrator? There, like? There's nothing to cover up. Of course there is. Because there's no warrant. They broke in there. And I'm supposed to report the sheriff's department to you. You want to have Timmy the Perjurer Riley investigate himself. That's not going to happen. If, if See, you it's have, your job to you, do that. If you have a complaint. I do. I already filed the complaint. I already have you on I, video with we it. We took your complaint. Yeah, uh, and you're trying and to pretend like nothing's happening no, with no, it. No, no, no. No, no, no. You're going to give Terry. it to the same people who are tampering with my evidence, who are withholding my evidence, just like you did the last time. You you're just going to bury Terry, it. You can try to put words in my mouth, but that's not what I'm saying. I know that's not what you're saying, but that's what, that's what, what's happening. See, because well, the I'm facts. I'm sorry that you feel that way. Uh, no, no, no. That's what the the facts show, Chief. In in your opinion. No, no, no. That's I have clear, precise, and unquestionable evidence. See, you think you guys can just bury this and make it go away? You think you can stick me in a box for a long time, and I'm just going to quit? It's not going to happen, Chief. Terry. Yes. Again, I'm not going to argue with you, Ken. I'm not. Here I'm not arguing. I'm that. stating facts. Listen, You're the one who is arguing with me. Well, here's what we're going to do. What? If there's something that you'd like to report, if you'd like to make a complaint, I will sit down with you. I will take your complaint. I will audio record that for you. Okay. But I'm not going to sit here and argue and let you record this and be a part of your YouTube videos. Okay. That's not my job. I'm not here to do that. Okay. If you want to come down and sit down with me in my office, I will turn the tape recorder on. You can give a statement. We can forward it to the prosecutor. Yeah, forward to the same like. people who <clears throat> covered it up before. See. But you, again, I'm, I'm not going to keep doing this with you, Terry. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's fine. That's fine. Because all I need to do is just have you say that you're not going to do anything. I'm not saying that I'm not going to do anything. Well, the, obviously you aren't doing anything. See? We because are, we have evidence from a former okay, attorney again, general Terry, saying. Unless you want to go and sit down. Make a complaint. I'll tape record it. I already did make a complaint. Okay. Then, then we're done. Well, then let's go tape record it. Okay. Then you got to go put your camera back in your car. So I can't tape record my own uh, statement, then, right? Not with an audio camera. Really? Because I did it before with you. Yes, you did, and I shouldn't have allowed that. Oh, why is that? Because there's protected stuff that's in my office. Well, then let's do it out here, then. Okay, but I am not going to be a part of your YouTube videos. Well, how are you going to do that, then? Okay, I will take a statement from you, Terry. I'm more than willing to do that. Take a complaint from you, but not on your camera. Really? What law says that? Um, that's what we have been advised to do. You By whom? Terry? By whom? I'm telling you that that's how it's going to work. By whom? Okay. By Neil Nelson? Neil the Tamperer Nelson? If you don't want to go along with that, then we're going to be done. Really? Yes. Well, then I guess we're done, then. Okay. All right. So, oh, how about my mother? I think my mother maybe wants to make a complaint against Timmy the Perjurer Riley you, for breaking into her you, home without a would warrant. Would you like to come in and sit down and talk to me about this? You tape it. <clears throat> Here's the information right there. Tell me, broke in your house without a warrant. 
Is that something that you'd like to do? I can do it. Okay. All right then. I will sit down. This is Go ahead. Mother. This is my mother, Gail Nemers. Okay. Then have a seat over there, Terry, and you can wait till we're done. Sounds great. Oh, do you want the probable cause statement too? There you go, probable cause statement. Okay, and this is issued from you on your behalf. That's a copy of what they gave me after they broke in my house without a warrant. Okay. That's the Timmy the Perjure Riley's perjured statements. Okay. We got all the doors locked. Yeah, I wonder why. You know why, Terry. Yeah, I know why. It's a big cover up. Have a seat. It's not a cover up. I don't need to sit down. <laughs> Oh, I let me have one page out of here. I'm gonna. Actually, I'll let you have the probable cause statement. I'll keep everything. Else. You want me to keep this? For the duration of her this visit complaint? with you. Okay. You okay. can make a copy of it. You're more than welcome to do that.